Alabama's state motto is we dare defend our rights. As the battle over abortion rights heats up here, Vocative went to Montgomery and found some people with very different views of what those rights should be. We will show her these little um, babies. This is seven weeks, eight, nine, and ten. In Alabama, a minor who wants an abortion must prove they've received counseling on alternatives at a clinic such as this. Minors must also get permission from a parent. Girls too afraid to face their parents can ask a judge for permission. Juliana Taylor has represented over 60 girls who've asked a judge for permission to get an abortion. I remember a little girl who told me that she was going to have a mixed race baby and that her daddy had told her that if she came home pregnant by a black man that he would beat her and he would kill the baby. But now a new law enacted in April encourages judges to appoint lawyers for fetuses. I am a civil rights attorney. The greatest civil right of all is life itself. I believe in extending that right to the unborn. You understand what that means? The fetus has been given the right to appeal a decision up to a higher court. For the first time ever, the new law also allows witnesses to testify against the girl. And that district attorney can ask questions. Now we have someone who can cross-examine in an adversarial capacity. If the little girl says, I work very hard, make good grades, they call in the guidance counselor at her school to see if the little girl is telling the truth, like a criminal. The new law even allows outsiders to tie up the decision in the court. You now have other lawyers who can appeal that decision and say, this little girl throws temper tantrums when she doesn't get her way. She doesn't spend her allowance wisely. The fetus is appealing. Crisis pregnancy centers are among the places that offer the kind of counseling that minors are to seek by law. We do tell everyone that we are not abortion clinic, but we have all the information that you would need. This is a 12-week model that we um, give her to take home. We suggest adoption as an alternative, and we really promote that. Well, I think what is most cruel is uh, not to tell a young woman what the risk and the liabilities uh, of an abortion are. To wake up later and say, oh my God, I killed a child that could have been mine. I got a Christmas card one year. It didn't have anything written in it. Didn't have a signature, just initials. So I don't know the name of the girl who sent it, but I know how I helped.